So a data management plan is basically a blueprint for what you're going to do with that data throughout the life cycle, so throughout your research project. And you may not have thought of everything, but at least by planning, you can avoid major pitfalls of data loss and you can predict what you'll need to do in order to share the data at the end if that's, if that's what's needed. So for example, you can get the right kind of forms of consent from your data subjects and you can get the costs up front for the services that you'll need and you can put that into your grant so that the funders will pay it and that you, you won't be stuck without the services that you need. Um, so, so the data management plan ideally is a living document that you start when you write your research proposal and it will change over time and the research data support team can help you make those adjustments as you go. Yeah, so for me the emergence of more attention to data management and the creation of data management plans and, and then tools like um, DMP online are really useful. Now that there's much more attention to data management, having a tool like DMP online, which is, is really a series of prompts to get you to think through, um, as a researcher, to, to think through um, different aspects of what you're doing and how you're going to do it. I think it's really useful to have that structure um, uh, of DMP online um, because it uh, can draw your attention to things that you're not quite thinking about yet, I suppose. Where are you going to store this data? Who will have access to us? Um, you know, during the research, after the research. So those nitty gritty questions are now, uh, that level of detail is now kind of really important, I suppose. I mean, particularly because obviously a lot of our data is now um, digital and um, can travel <laughs> kind of much more easily. Thinking through the detail of where the data is going to be and who has access to it is now just really, really crucial um, in research projects. Um, yeah, and DMP Online really helps to structure thinking around that. There is a website where you can actually go there and just understand how to organize a data management plan, which is data management plan online. So I used that platform to create mine and it was quite helpful because at the beginning you don't know how to <laughs> how to write it, you know, like the structure and everything. So actually I used that website and I integrated like, all the questions that they suggested. And yeah, basically I did my data management plan based on that website. I was working uh, on building up my data management plan. At the beginning I had like, plenty of doubts and questions, so I contacted them by email and they would just respond very quickly and very nicely. So it was really, really good support. So actually I sent my data management plan, they reviewed them and sent me some comments and feedback. So, you know, the communication was so fluently like all the time. So I really appreciate that support. So there's a number of ways the research data support team can help researchers with writing a data management plan. Uh, first of all, we have an online training module in our Mantra training course, and you can just go and take that at, at your own pace. Uh, we also have advice on our website, and we have a library of sample plans, so we may be able to find something close to your discipline or close to your project size that, that would uh, make a good example. The Digital Curation Center provides an online tool called DMP Online, and we've managed to customize that for University of Edinburgh. So if you're responding to a data management plan requirement from a particular funder, you can pull up those, um, those instructions and then you can get guidance on the kinds of University of Edinburgh services that are available. So you can do some cutting and pasting of um, certain kinds of text into the plan. We also have experts at knowing what the funder requirements are and who've helped other people. So you could sit down with them or iterate a plan online back and forth by email. We have people who will put the time in to find out about your requirements and help you write the data management plan and get it right so that you'll win that project funding.